Hey guys, how's it going? This is what I'm going to do, guys. I'm going to try to answer any of your, some of your questions. I will try to do this at least once a day because it's not much going on really right now. Okay, so let's go to the first one. This wasn't really a question. This was more like a statement. Okay, Paul, I want to sell the house now and I don't care if I get the same price that I paid for it. I just want to get rid of it. So listen, guys, the whole world is panicking right now. And my advice to you, this is not the time to make irrational decision. We will get to this, guys. I promise. Well, the reason why I'm saying this, if you go back in history, we always get to tough times. This will pass. I don't know when, but it will pass. We'll get through this and we'll come out stronger than ever. I truly believe that. Do not panic. What's going on right now, this is the first for our generation. No one has seen this before. Don't make any irrational decision right now. Just take this time, maybe, you know, reflect on certain things. Yes, this is a tough time. But remember, we all in it together. We all in it together, guys. We will get through it. Soon, sooner or later, we will get through it, guys. Stay together and help each other out, protect each other. So I'll be back tomorrow. Don't forget, you can text, email, or DM me any of your questions. And if you want to chat, if you want to be on here too, I'll put you on. Just let me know. We can get it done. I'll put my, I'll put my number somewhere on the screen and down, down below. And one word of caution, guys, if anyone call you on the phone and asking for your personal information, social security, date of birth, pretending to be the government, just hang up the phone. The government is not calling people. They're not asking you for your social security number and names to send you checks in the mail. They are not doing that. The government is not calling anyone. They are not verifying any information over the phone. Furthermore, if anyone trying to come to your house, pretending to be the police, the CDC, or any health professionals dressing in white coat, or hazmat suit, pretending to be uh, corona testers, just call the police. Don't open your door, just call the police on them. Unfortunately, some people are trying to take advantage of this mess going on right now. Just remember that guys, the government is not calling you. They're not asking you for your personal information to send you a check. They're not coming to your house to test you for corona. If any of, if any, you get any of these calls, hang up the phone. If they come to your house, do not open your door, call the police. Anyway, guys, if this is your first time here, my name is Paul with Sunset Oils and Silver Insurance. I will try to do this once a day. And if you don't need anything out there, try to stay home as much as possible. That's the way we, we protect each other. The best thing you can do right now to protect each other is staying home. If you don't need anything out there, I understand that you, if you need the grocery store, the pharmacy, you have to go. That's different than just going out there with with the business. The thing is, you're not only protecting yourself, but you're protecting a bunch of other people because you might have it and you don't even know. Four out of five people who give this thing to other people they don't even know they have it. So that's how we help each other. Stay at home as much as possible. Thank you again for watching. My name is Paul again with Sunset Wheels and Silver Insurance. If this is your first time here, please subscribe so you don't miss any of our next videos and stay safe guys. Peace.